turn 24. Hook took the watchtower I had on the. Uh, actually, it's not displayed anymore. Ah, yeah, it's here. So that was this watchtower with a wisp. And he's still uh, probably m absorbing cities. But it's, it's weird for this one, I don't see any spo smoke. I may be here. Anyway, um, in one turn I will get this as a vessel, but I had a very bad surprise here, which that uh, price to join Empire uh, skyrocketed because I don't have any city uh, close by anymore, so it's plus two hundred percent costs, uh, so it's very expensive, and uh, yeah, so I cannot buy them anymore and it would not really make sense to buy them at 800 so I hope to take this and after I take it um, be able to buy them but first I'd like to clear this to avoid uh, having some nasty roamers the issue is that I don't really have good troops to uh, to kill them because the wisps the wisps um, static shield doesn't work on undead and uh, the titan is doing enormous damage so it's going to be tough but I, I'll do my best and probably have to retreat once try to split them use the regrowth from the crusher and use the ogre to um to kill the titan uh and then so go take this then take the the regrowth and then probably move back and try to capture back my cities with um master regionist and regrowth uh the spider egg hatched so now i've got phase on my leader i ah, know i don't okay <laughs> I thought Hunter Spider Mount would give face, but no, that's a bit stupid. Okay. Um, my rogue leveled up. We're going to show them to see the results of the fight just after. But so I'm taking Assassin Strike, and Stealth Commander would be nice, but no need to take it immediately. So maybe just nothing for now. Clock and dagger would be nice to to be able to cast more spells, especially uh, the quick dash. But let's let's keep our points uh, and see when I can use them wisely, and especially the stealth commander and poison knowledge actually too would be very interesting against my opponent. But yeah, for now let's let's wait. Oh, two goes here. What's what's going on? Um. So yeah, the fight I did. I did this fight and I actually took a lot of damage, especially on the one of the ogre. Because I realized I don't have re. Really <laughs> I have only fire damage, like this one fire damage, fire damage, fire damage, and 100% fire protection for 3 units out of, fu out of 4 and the other one had 60% uh, I think thanks to the um, Draconian Ancestry and second fight I did was the quest uh, no, first fight I did was the quest and it was also a stupid fight like Wisp against Wisp is not really efficient so took some damage and got the Ogre as a reward and now these guys are happy and I actually could ask for a second tribute, but um, probably not the best thing to do now uh, because I don't have that much gold. So I'm going to ask for it later. Also, it, it will give them time to replenish the value of the reward. For as far as I know, it works like this. Now the value is only 144 mana uh, gold. It will increase over time. And uh, what else? Ah, yeah. 
they offered the tribute, so I accepted and this that's these guys. I'm going to just secure the inn and wait uh until the rest of my army arrives and then I can continue. Actually I should maybe send the crusher to level up to get uh better better regrowth. But yeah. I'm probably going to clear these sites um, because it's it's better to uh, get an advantage from clearing, getting level ups, and especially charm on my on my rogue at level seven. While he is here and he cannot clear anything and cannot get any gold, so I have to use my advantage of being able to clear. And finally, in the ground, uh, I'm still checking the area. And I'm afraid I'm going to be killed by some rumors soon without finding anyone. But uh, we'll see. Oh, gold stash. So I, I, I would need to take these two gold stash. I'm casting one more wisp here to take the gold stash here and the other one here. And uh, explore and then move to check my old throne. Oh, actually, there is still gold here also. Didn't see. Thanks for watching, see you next time.